Connecticut new video tonight showing a giant oak tree crashing. Take a look at the video here in the back. As you can see through this severe weather passing through Bridgeport. Now Success Village is coming together to help three families displaced. Frank Recchia has the exclusive for us tonight. I've been living here in Success Village for eight years. 52 year old Maria Rivera says her life here at Success Village has been extremely happy for almost a decade. A community known for the many great white oaks that fill the property and help give it its character. But when this 140 year old great white oak came crashing down on building 10 Saturday afternoon, as seen in this extraordinary security camera video, just look at it. It's a nightmare. The life Maria built here in building 10 also came crashing down. Her apartment destroyed by water damage. Basically, it's here, which is a kitchen and living room. Along with the bathroom, which she just spent eight grand remodeling. She wasn't home at the time, but says for the first time ever, she understands what it's like to be one of those people you see on the news who lose everything in a natural disaster. After you work so hard for everything that you have and having it gone in within seconds. Look at the apartment above Rivera's, which luckily was unoccupied. The great white oak ripping a great wide hole in the roof. That's what led to the water damage during the few minutes that heavy rain poured on the complex. Everything is under here. I don't know how bad my clothes are. My daughter said my clothes are wet. We have three members, including Maria, Ms. R Rivera here, um, who were displaced. But the new Success Village president, Ty Bird, says thanks to the association's insurance coverage, all three families are staying at a high-end hotel until the condos can be repaired. I've been through a lot for the past two years. Losing my job, lost my, both of my parents, so it's a lot what I'm going through right now. She says she suspects the tree came crashing down, not just due to an act of God, but because she says when the sidewalks here were recently fixed, part of the tree roots were cut away. I thank God that nobody was home. I think I would have been a wreck if I was in my house when this happened. An extraordinary turn of events and nobody was hurt. Bird says the displaced families will get the help they need because it takes a village to support a community. And that's exactly what Success Village is. It's a village, it's a family. In Bridgeport, Frank Recchia, News 12, Connecticut. Rivera and the association telling us they'll be pressing for answers to find out if work done during that recent sidewalk construction weakened the tree, causing it to fall.